We're back with another Blue Collar Bites video. This time, we're gonna make some chili verde. You're gonna need some ingredients. Let's start with the seasoning. You're gonna need Goya Perfect Seasoning, Goya Adobe All-Purpose Seasoning. You're also gonna need some virgin olive oil, some minced garlic. If we look at produce, you're gonna need some yellow onions. For this recipe, I'm using two, three jalapenos, three poblano peppers, around 20 tomatillos. You will need those, low sodium chicken broth, some tortillas, and then the star of the show, the pork chops. You're gonna wanna peel your tomatillos just like this. Once you've got them peeled, I always like to give them a quick rinse. And now we're gonna cut up a couple of onions. All right, y'all. I'm gonna interrupt the show real quick because I wanna show you this cutting board. So a uh, buddy of mine named Ben over at Firewood Designs, he made this for me and it is freaking amazing. I was afraid to use it for the longest time because I didn't wanna put scratches on it and it just, I don't know, special to me. Um, but I caved and I've started using it and I keep my knife sharp. I'm, I'm very uh, particular about the blades that I use. I keep an edge on them and uh, you can probably see a little bit of the scoring on it from the blade but you can't feel it it's crazy um, this is high quality uh, you can feel it it has some weight to it like this is this is top notch so i know he would appreciate it if you would go over there and give him a follow again it's firewood designs he's on facebook he's on instagram so go check him out and if you want one of these hit him up Got the oven on 500 degrees, which is broil, and then we're gonna use a skillet. Okay, while the pan's warming up, we're gonna go ahead and dice up our pork. I've got uh, just some pork chops that I found at Kroger, and I'm gonna cut them up into like inch by inch cubes. After you see the olive oil starting to start to smoke a little bit, let me throw your pork in. We're also gonna apply some of the adobe. Looks like the veggies are done. Now that the veggies are done, and they're all nice and charred up, we're gonna slap them into the blender, blend them up, and then throw them over here in our hot plate. Now it's time to do a little taste test. So good. Once you got your pork all nice and seared up and you want a good sear on it, go ahead and throw this in this pan. So like I said, we've got a little bit of that fried pork on the bottom of that pan. We're gonna go ahead and pour this in there. Now that we've got it in this pan, we're gonna take about a heavy tablespoon of garlic. Just sprinkle that in there. All right, you can hear it starting to sizzle. We're getting that garlic to adhere. So we're gonna put a little bit of this perfect seasoning. As you can see, it's got the Holy Trinity in it. We're also gonna put a little bit more of the adobe. You wanna go easy with this. It's simmering. I got it on a medium heat. We're probably gonna let this go for 30, 45 minutes and then we're ready to eat. The time has come to dig into the chili verde and it's looking amazing. So all of that verde sauce is now like soaked up into the meat. It's still got that crisp, but it, it just has now absorbed all of that flavor. And we're ready to eat. I got a plate here all assembled. My wife made some Mexican rice some chorizo refried beans, we've got some tortillas, and I put a little bit of uh, avocado and cilantro on as a garnish. This is kind of what the plate looks like. We're gonna give it a taste. A little bit of rice, a little bit of verde sauce, a little bit of pork chop. Wow. 
bro, that's good. This is really good. That's that's a good bite. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. You can do us a favor. Go ahead and check us out on social media. We've got Facebook, Instagram, we got a TikTok. Also, like this video. It means a lot to us. It means you support it. it means you like what we're doing. And uh, we we got some big things in store this year. We're really excited about. Hopefully, uh, we'll get those rocking here soon. We'll catch you in the next one. Dear God, um, let us to our bodies and help our Papa Mama to drive home safely. Amen. Amen. Good job, dude.